Hello and welcome to Mock Productions, you're here with me, Matthew, and we are back with another unboxing, or oh, in this case, unpackaging. Um, let's just say this package is uh, slightly damaged, to say the least. Yeah, um, this is a hole. <laughs> um, yes, it's, uh, it's, uh... <laughs> It survived. Let's just say it survived. Hopefully everything is in here and accounted for. Not that hard to actually just get it open, really. And pull out a little bit of insulation. Which can be popped. <laughs> and then we can pull out what we've got inside. Yeah. Ah oh, yes. Here we go. Two nitro soda skimmers. Oh boy, do these look awesome. They really do look pretty awesome. So, let's take a little look at this. Looking really cool, the normal nitro gold and white sort of deco here. Sorry, yes, gold and white. Um, looking really awesome. I'm loving the, the work they've done to this. It's fantastic, nice and shiny. Looking really, really cool. On the front there, on the back there, we have got every single one except for Tomb Buggy. Uh, you can see there, if you combine it with Pop Fizz and this, you get the ultimate one. But seeing as this is the Nitro, that's the normal one there. Seeing as this is the Nitro, oh wow, that does look pretty cool. Uh, you can see there how to do it. Battle villains and vehicles. And there's the vehicle there, looking really, really cool. So let's just have a little quick glance at these and see which one's better on paint. Um, I think the overall thing is the white paint which might be smudged or slightly right there's a little bit of a mark on this one I don't know if you can see that with there it's slightly over and this one is better so this one's gonna be opened this one's gonna stay in box so there we go and obviously it does say they're only at Target now I don't know in terms of the UK where these are coming out um, I have no idea let's just raise this up slightly a little bit um, <clears throat> I got no idea where these are actually coming out in the UK um, <laughs> But, uh, yeah, let's open it up and see what it's like. Place that one to the back. Ugh. There we go. Okay. Let's open them up. Pull it out. Drop the ticket. Let's have a little look at the ticket. There it is. Nitro Soda Skimmer. Looking really cool with normal pop fizz there. And you can see it there. And just for a little comparison there, there is Birthday Bash, Big Bubble, Pop Fizz, oh yeah, look at that, looking pretty cool. So there's uh, there's the, uh, the sticker there, so move this off to the side, bring this back in. Uh, my guess is nothing will move on this thing, it's going to be a solid piece of plastic. Oh, that is actually very interesting, that is awesome, um, first thing out of the box is it's slightly smudged, but a little bit of uh, wet finger, and that's that's sorted. Um, that is very, very cool. What they've basically done is the bottom, I know you can't really see or feel this on uh, camera, but on, on the bottom, the parts where it got inflated, they've actually tried to make it as if it's like the rubbery material. So it's got that rubbery sort of texture. It's sort of movable, you can see I'm moving it there. Um, and slightly squishy, I don't know if you can see, uh, it's very, very hard to squish. But that means it's not really going to go anywhere, you know, on, on here, it's not going to move. You can see I'm, I'm pushing it, and it is sort of stopping it from sliding. Obviously, if I kept doing that, it probably might scratch the, uh, the paintwork and everything. But you can see, <laughs> look how wonky that is. <laughs> slightly squished, I bet you that's actually meant to happen, or maybe it just needs to, might have warped in the package possibly, um, but it looks so, so cool, it's really awesome, done a really fantastic job with this, I really like the idea of this, the sort of rubbery texture, and it also like sort of moves as well, each part moves slightly to give it that edge of it, of it as if it was uh, moving and bobbing around and everything like that, very, very cool. There's a steering wheel there as well. It's a bit like a stopwatch. <laughs> like all this trumpet combo thing going on back here. All the pistons and pipes there. You've got the nice deco here. Really, really cool. Um, so, let's bring in everyone's favourite. Spinny Dial of Doom. 
and place that on there. Now of course we're going to have to uh, display it with a pop fizz and the only pop fizz I have is this. Now subscriber did actually uh, comment saying um, when you get the Nitro Soda Skimmer why don't you do the character thing. I'm planning on doing that uh, when? I don't know. Um, but yes, I do have it now, so I'll be getting it out as quick as possible. Um, but uh, yeah, that's, that's all I'm going to say on that front, because there are a few things coming up which uh, might cause delays on the old Skylander videos. But there is, uh, obviously there's Pop Fizz with, hit, with the Soda Skimmer. Got to have the Splatter Splasher next to it. Looking really, really nice. Really cool. <coughs> which that's pretty cool let's just put that in the middle there and whilst that's spinning round just just to give people a comparison of the actual box and everything there it is see compared to the E3 hot street not to rub it in so we'll just cover it up <laughs> um, but uh, you can see there looking pretty cool I like how they put them on a downward sort of slope it's really cool the background pictures are always awesome which is also a bonus so there, there's that but of course we're focusing mainly on the Nitro Soda Skimmer here. Very, very cool. I like, I, I always like finding out different things. You know, this one doesn't move. Um, the Sky Slicer doesn't move. So it's not like, you know, as awesome as some of the others. I mean, you see my reactions to some of them and some of them are a bit crazy. But um, I like how they've made the, the, the bottom of this rubbery. Um, I don't know how they could have possibly got this any any movement involved. Maybe the the horns could have moved slightly, like jiggled back and forth like that. I'm not too sure, but uh, they're they're really awesome. I quite like the vehicles, and I do hope they are sort of brought into the next game um, in some respect. You know, obviously not um, ma major, but at least there's something there. Maybe you can do like the online racing again, and it's more tracks and everything. But it is really really cool. So there we go, there is the unboxing <coughs> for Nitro Soda Skimmer. So if you have enjoyed this, make sure to hit that subscribe button below. You can also comment down below um, anything in general about the, the overall character of the Soda Skimmer. Any moves in particular you know are going to be pretty effective if you've already got him. And also, well, yeah, anything in general. <laughs> Uh, uh, you can uh, rate the video as well so I know you're enjoying the unboxing series and subscribe to the channel for more. So thank you very much for watching, I'll see you guys then, thank you and goodbye. Soda Skimmer, Gushing Geysers, Inner Beast Tube, Alchemic Admixture. Supercharged. Okay, so here we are, back with an unexpected bit of gameplay after that unboxing. Um, we have the showcase for Pop Fizz, or should I say, uh, Big Bubble Pop Fizz, and also the Nitro Soda Skimmer. So this will be the showcase for Pop Fizz. Now, the actual Pop Fizz will, um, is coming out rather... Oh, hello! How are you today? Tune up your vehicles. So, you dokey. Sounds pretty cool. No. Goodbye. That robot appeared again. Um, let's see his moves, actually. He walks rather weird, but... Oh, wow, look at that. He's got bubbles. And... Oh, of course, you can't go without the creature mode. And he goes back. Nice. Cool. Pretty effective attack there. But here we go. Let's start his supercharger Super challenge. Combo is authorized. Proceed to your challenge. Okie dokie. Here we go. Collect as many active potions, blue or red, as possible before the end of the race. Right, so we need 250,000 points. Can we do it? Fingers are crossed. Let's do it. It's a boat. It's a boat. Or at least it's a sea vehicle. We can give it our best shot. Get round, 
said to never walk my speed machine. Let's collect ammo pods to refill your ammo bar faster. So when it sneezes, it's going to basically turn over to the other one. Okay. Okay, let's do it. Ready. Three, two, one, go! Red. Time it perfectly right. Don't like boats. Have rubbish steering. Right. Yeah. So idealistically. Normally, if you're playing one of these and you've got to finish in a certain time, maybe I should be looking for maybe around 175-ish. Now, of course, it doesn't look like that. But, if we keep going with the combo... Don't sneeze, don't 
Oh, got it. Yes, awesome. Good, good, good. Okay, over to the blues. Score though, pretty happy with that. Got a wish stone as well, so that's pretty cool. Let's go back to the academy. Our rewards. Now let me know in the comments below if you want to see more of this. Maybe once I've done the unboxing for a specific character, do you want to see gameplay of it afterwards? Um, obviously, there are some still to come, so maybe when they are like released there's an unboxing and then you get the showcase for them seen as all the ones that are coming up are actually going to be new so the showcase would work um, but yeah let me know in the comments below so I know it's below so I know that was a rhyme oh wow Soda Skimmer Supercharged Awesome Give me my wish stone Go bubbles go like actually when he's doing that. He's just sort of blowing into it. Bouncy hello. Hey Skylander, can you do me a favor and use your sea vehicle to go on a deep dive for some gear bits? Okay. Why was that never actually there before? It'll be experience though. Or a hat. Mm, a hat. 
that. No. Oh my gosh, what? Level 11? <laughs> Look at his health. 732 health. Holy moly, that guy is pretty cool. Throw a wish stone in. Probably another hat. Oh, there we go. Finally, we get the radio hat. Oh, it wasn't a hat. It was actually a legendary treasure. Oh. Okay, that was pretty cool. Right. Hello, Persephone. Any place that you go, I can reach and bring you the magical upgrades. Press X to cause a chemical reaction and transform the colour and effects of liquid attacks. So from it being a bubble to slime to... What's that? Electricity or something like that. That's pretty interesting. Know your base. All base liquid attacks do more damage. Right, okay. Oh, wow. Oh, that's pretty cool. Uh, genetic engineering. Press X while in beast mode to perform new attacks depending on current... Oh, that's pretty cool. That's pretty cool. Side effects. After reverting to normal pop fizz, gain a temporary defense boost. Oh, that's pretty cool. Larger lungs. Look at that, it upgrades the back of it. Gains additional effects depending upon the liquid color. Okay. Perform enhanced and longer versions of the U. Beast form do more damage. I'm a monster roll. <laughs> a better beast attack. Press Y after using the better beast attack to do more damage with claws. One in beast mode, hold and release Y to... What? This is awesome! Um, personally, I might go with the bottom one, but if I get to really like all of these different attacks, that it, you know, because it's obviously this bubble thing here, it's pretty effective, you can just tap it and go, and it sort of, they sort of bounce, they do their thing. Do they ricochet? Do ricochet, which will be really, really awesome. So my choice would probably be the bottom for now, knowing beast mode and how much it is fun. But if this attack is really like awesome once it starts getting leveled up and you get the different effects, then maybe it might be useful to uh, upgrade that one instead. But let me know in the comments below which one you would do. Hey, Pop Fizz, heard you've been working on some new soda concoctions. Got any that enhance secret ninja commando super senses? Um, I think it was supposed to make my memory better, but I forgot. Ah! Hmm, too bad. How about we see your genetic engineering in action for your first mission? But we don't have genetic engineering. Stick to the training program, Skylander, and you won't go wrong. Orion. But there we go guys, there is that. So you can obviously subscribe for more unboxings and also showcases which will be coming up for the rest of this week. Uh, you can also comment down below like I've said throughout the uh, video and also rate the video so I know you're enjoying the showcase series. Thank you very much guys for watching, I'll see you guys then. Thank you and goodbye.